Fallout games are all massive and filled with a ton of exciting easter eggs and references for players to discover throughout their journeys in the wasteland. So in today's video, I'm giving you my top easter eggs in Fallout 76. Starting off our video, if players head to the parking lot outside of Camden Park, there is a school bus with a series of wooden blocks spelling out magic laying on the dashboard. In the driver's seat of the bus, there is an orange tie Mr. Fuzzy with a clipboard and a clown hat. This whole set is a reference to Miss Frizzle from the educational cartoon The Magic School Bus. Seatbelts, everyone! Please let this be a normal field trip with a friend. For this next easter egg, you're going to want to make your way over to Vault 96. Once here, take the path west and there will be a carriage carrying three dead sellers that resembles the intro scene from Skyrim. This is also a possible location to wake up after drinking Nuga Shine, referencing the Skyrim's player character in the carriage during the opening cinematic. Our next easter egg on the list is just north of Sugar Grove and here we can find an unmarked location called Barrel Burial Site. Here an individual was given pre-war money to bury some contaminated barrels. The scene of the skeleton in their lab coat, the partially buried barrels, a picker up, several stacks of cash and gas masks are all a reference to the scene from Breaking Bad in which Walter White buried barrels of cash in the desert. For our next little easter egg on the list, players are going to need to make their way east of the Tyler County Fairgrounds to an unmarked location known as Party Time Diners. Here, there is a table at the top of the mountain reminiscent of the Mad Hatter's Tea Party in Alice in Wonderland. There's also even several hats and board games all around. You lose your heads. Already lost them. <laughs> <laughs> all together now. <laughs> this next easter egg on our list is located at the lovely town of Point Pleasant. Here there is a spooky church and on the back of the church is a door drawn in chalk with a book lying on the ground next to it. This whole setup is a reference to the Beetlejuice movie where Barbara and Adam follow the guy to the book of the recently deceased and draw a door in chalk on a wall which looks identical to the one we find. Draw a door. I don't know why we keep looking in that stupid book. You didn't actually think that was going to work, did you? Our next easter egg on the list brings us back to Camden Park. Here players can read the Camden Park terminal injuries from Marty Porkins who was promoted to the position of assistant to the park manager before the title was changed to assistant park manager. This easter egg is of course a reference to the gag from the hit tv show The Office in which Dwight repeatedly claims he's the assistant regional manager, forcing others to correct him on his actual position, the assistant to the original manager, a much less valuable title. And so we're going to have to have a couple people come in on the weekends and I know nobody's going to want to do it and everybody's going to complain and bitch and I don't want to have to deal with it. And that's why you have an assistant regional manager. Yes, it is. Assistant to the regional manager. Same thing. No, it's not. It's lower. So it's close. This next easter egg on our list can be found in the middle of the dried up Summersville Lake east of the lakeside cabins near Red Boat. Here we can find a female skeleton lying on a door reaching out to a partially sunken arm from another skeleton. This reference mimics the famous scene in the Titanic where characters Rose and Jack are floating in the water trying to survive. This next easter egg on our list is a huge one, so to find it, you're going to need to make your way over to the Torrance house. Here, players can find many references to the horror movie, The Shining. The name of the house itself, Torrance, is the same name of the family from the movie. We have the red rum scene on the second floor, and you can also find the hedge maze scene in the back with a skeleton lying next to an axe. Red rum. Red rum. Red rum. Red rum. Red Rum! Red Rum! For this next easter egg on our list, players need to make their way over to Tanagra Town. Here, players will find graffiti on the wall of the bus stop that says Darmok plus Jalad on it. The name of this town and the graffiti on the wall is all a reference to the Star Trek The Next Generation episode, Darmok. In this episode, an alien ambassador from a race communicates using only metaphors, constantly making a reference to Darmok and Jalad from Tanagra. The River Tamak in winter. Darmok. And Jalad at Tanagra. Damak and Jalad on the ocean. So Kath, his eyes open! The next easter egg on our list is just north of Point Pleasant located at an unmarked location on the riverbed. Here players can find a white boat with a mutated dolphin that looks like he's about to eat a skeleton. This whole setup is a reference to the scene in the Jaws movie where a fisherman boat gets attacked by the shark itself leading to one of the fisherman Quint's final moments.
If you enjoy fault content like this and you want to see more, I also made a video over one of the strongest shotguns in all of Fault 76, the Gauss shotgun. So if you want to check that video out, I'll link it in the screen right now. You see that? That is my Gauss shotgun video.